The fully electric Nissan LEAF has been zooming across the country of Mexico for months now. So far, only taxi drivers and government officials in Mexico City and at Aguas Calientes can drive them. But soon, anyone who wants one will be able to buy the Nissan LEAF. That's why the company is working hard to get more electric infrastructure in place. This electric vehicle charging center has the capacity to charge 50 LEAFs at one time. Mexico officials say it's the largest facility of its kind in the country and in all of Latin America. This center in Aguas Calientes services the 50 LEAF taxis in the area. There are also two quick chargers, one in the heart of Mexico City and the other in the city of Aguas Calientes, both for public use. Nissan officials say they hope to expand taxi programs and public charging like this to other cities and other countries in Latin America. I would say that Aguascalientes has been the, the benchmark on those, Mexico City as well. There's a lot of requests from, uh, from other countries. Colombia is pushing very hard and asking very hard, requesting a lot of uh, vehicles. Nissan Mexicana is also working to connect charging infrastructure from city to city. We are creating the first, we call it uh, in Spanish, Corredor Electrico, which is really the first electric corridor in the entire Latin America uh, region. It's going to be running from Mexico City up to Cuernavaca, in which we have another manufacturing facility. This will mean electric vehicle drivers could go 120 kilometers, that's about 75 miles, from one side of the corridor to the other. Nissan Mexicana officials say it should be ready for public use by June 6th. The Nissan LEAF will go on sale at dealerships in Mexico late this year. They are popular now, and I'm sure that with the right incentives, with the right support, I'm sure that those are going to be a lot more popular.